idiots. Too damn dense to comprehend the meaning of their own existence. Look at them. Rushing off the work, rushing to beat the clock. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Go ahead. Rush, 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 rush. Robots, automatons, mice running after the cheese and mass conformity. Go ahead, rush, rush. Where are you rushing to? You'll die of a heart attack with all your rushing. They'll soon rush you to a hospital. Don't say I didn't warn you. Jaime Schultz. Twelve years on the job, and I'm Jaime Schultz. Anonymous, unknown, dehumanized by the processes of a mechanized society. Brushed aside like a cockroach. No more. No more. From now on, you fight back. You hear me? You fight back. You have a letter for four C, a mailman, a uh, Mr. Mailman. Did you ask him? Yes, I asked him. Uh, don't you have a letter for four C? He's deaf. He doesn't listen. Well, don't they have to pass a physical examination in order to become mailman? They call three times. They become mailman. They get worse than worse. This one's a lunatic. All right. Yes. All right. Ladies, follow me. Come with me. All of you, come on down. Line up, line up, line up. Now, I want you ladies to get something straight for once and for all. Postal regulations prohibit the deliverance of any pieces of postage to any recipients of said pieces of postage until said pieces of postage are placed in a proper postage receptacle. I don't ever want to be annoyed or harassed like this again. Any questions? It's not only that I want an education, Beverly. What I'm really looking for is a way of life that will satisfy me on more than one level, that will fulfill me in more than one direction. I'm delighted. I am really delighted. It's about time you put your foot down and told him off. Well, who does he think he is? Who do they all think they are, hmm? I had the same trouble with Stanley until I got smart enough to get rid of him. What time do you have to be there? 5.30. I have to see a Mr. Henry at the office of the registrar. Oh, you don't know how nervous I feel. Don't be silly. They'll be glad to have you. And that's how I got my master's degree in sociology. You should have heard Jerry this morning. What did he say? He complained the usual. I told him. I said, Jerry, I will live my own life, too. Good for you. I will get my baccalaureate degree. Mm. What do you answer to that? I don't know. He uses toilet paper to blow his nose, and he blames me. He's so pig-headed. He lives in a small, dull world of lower middle-class concerns, and he thinks everyone else should live the same way. They're all the same. <sighs> Worthless. <sighs> all of them. <sighs> Smartest thing I ever did was to get rid of Stanley. Well, there's no substitute for being on one's own, for freedom, for being independent. Whatever happens, I'm not going to fall into the classic suburban rut. I find my life getting smaller and smaller. <gasps> later than I expected. Your, the kids are over at Doris's. Your dinner's in the refrigerator. It's a Mexican Ole TV dinner. It's supposed to be. Oh, don't be smart. There's no bull meat in it. 
I am not discussing that subject with you. You don't have to wait up for me. If I'm here till midnight, I'll be here till midnight. I might even stay at Beverly's. Any way you want it. Bye. anymore, Rosie. <laughs> you mope around the house. No, I'm not going to mope around the house anymore. It's no, just I... no good, Rosie. You fill me yeah. with guilt. I'm the one who's the guilty oh. one. Oh, what do you want me to do? I'm not asking you to marry me. I'm perfectly content to go on living with you on the original terms. We split all the expenses and we live together. What's so terrible about that? What's so terrible? I'm the one who has to carry the guilt around. It's me who's the guilty one. No, I'm not going to mope around the house anymore. I'm going to be very pleasant and, and you're going to hear me laughing more. It's just no gonna, good, I'm, I'm Rosie. You said have... that before. No, I can't go on living with this dirty guilt. Have... It's eating me up. Don't look. Have... Don't watch. Have... Goodbye, Rosie Krieger. <laughs> Yes, who is it? Gloria Fisk, Mr. Henry. Do you have an appointment with me? Yes, Mr. Henry. For what time is that, please? 7.30. Did you, did you, did you say Gloria Fisk? Yes, I did, Mr. Henry. How, how do you spell that, please? Fisk. F-I-S-K-E. Fisky, Fisky, isn't it Fisky? <laughs> That's cute. That's like Fisky, isn't it Fisky? Fisky? No. Uh, no, uh, it's Mrs. Gloria Fisk. I see. All right, one second. I'll, I'll, I'll be right with you. Thank you. M Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Uh, are, 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 you, are, are you still out there? Yes, Mr. Henry. Oh, well, uh, come in, come in. I have not got all evening here. The door is locked, Mr. Henry. Well, then find the custodian and, 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 and get a key. I, uh, use your initiative, young lady. Uh, where would I find a custodian, Mr. Henry? Oh, he's, uh, uh... <laughs> no, no, one moment. I, I, I will open the door for you. Come in, come in, come in, please. Uh, unfortunately, I'm terribly busy, and we have to make this brief. Very brief and get, you know, right to the point. There are other people just as anxious about their educational careers as you are, Mrs. Uh, sit down, please. Well, uh, Mrs., what is it? Mrs. Fisk. 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 I'll try to be as brief as possible. Don't smoke Mrs. here. No, I, I will. Well... Mrs. Is uh, there anything wrong? No, I don't think so. Well, why do you, uh, you know, you, you stare at me that way. <laughs> oh, no, I wasn't. Well, no, Miss, what is that name, please? Mrs. Mrs. Fisk. Fisk, let me warn you right here and now that in this institution you give as much respect to the registrar as you do to your academically inclinated professors. Now, we do not draw the line on this because the... Because above all other things, you see, it, uh, considering that all things are, uh, despite, now, excuse me, please, despite modern uh, conveniences and fashions, excuse me, please. Don't.
Mrs. Fisk. Mrs. Fisk, I I can't seem to open the door. Is, is there a key in the top drawer? Oh, look. Which drawer would it be? To the left. No, it isn't. Well, then we'll just have to conduct the interview in this way. Uh, what What is the problem? Mr. Henry, what I'm interested in is re-entering this term in order to achieve uh -huh. my baccalaureate degree. I've already completed two years of undergraduate work. Ah, uh -huh, I see. And now what I'd like to do is attend evening school in order to complete the other two years. Uh -huh. Even if it takes three years to do. Uh huh. And uh, I would appreciate it uh -huh. if it's possible. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. Go on, please. Beverly, they won't accept me. I just spoke to Mr. Henry. It's not that, it's a technicality. If you wait more than five years, you lose all undergraduate credits. They don't make any exceptions. I practically begged him. I don't know what I'm going to do. It means I won't get my baccalaureate. I won't. I can't start at the beginning. I, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'll call you tomorrow. Bye. Bones, lady. Primitive animal strength. There's no arguing with that. You stay right there, you hear me? Don't move. Don't budge an inch. I'll be right there. One minute. In one minute. Well, you get... Come back. Damn it, you get back here and sit in that chair. Do you hear what I said? What are you doing? Sit in that chair. Please. Oh, what are you doing? Take this off, please. I can't breathe under here. I can't. Go ahead. You can scream if you want to, lady. Go ahead and scream. No, no, I'm not screaming. I'm cooperating. <laughs> Won't do you any good. We're alone. Yes. We're quite, quite alone. Yes. Another thing, lady. Yes. No conditions, you hear me? Yes. No conditions of any kind. That's something I insist on. Yes. You raise your voice once, yes. and I'll end your life right here without any preliminary discussions. Is that clear? Now it's now, 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 now. now. 
Where did you come from? What is it? What is this? A joke? Where's the other one? Where did she? Where did she go? What are you? What the? What are you trying? This is silly. This is ridiculous. Really, let me go, please. Go, 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 go. go, go, go. Let you go. Let you go. With all that trouble of pedaling a broken bike for three miles, getting soaked in the rain. Not a chance. Not tonight, lady. Not tonight. But, but I, I, I won't tell anyone, really. I didn't see you. Look, look, I had my eyes closed. You see, they're still closed. I don't know what you look like. Isn't it enough? I'll never get my baccalaureate degree. Isn't that enough for one night? Please, oh, please. Let me go. <laughs> cry. Go ahead, cry. Your tears are beautiful. I could watch you cry all night. Sometimes the tiger has to claw the tigress. Then she understands what it's all about. If you would listen to me. Not until you have my permission to speak. Is that clear? May I have a cigarette, please? No. It's cold in here. I'm freezing. You could make yourself some easy money if you would just let me go. My husband would be glad to give it to you. Why don't you phone him? Wouldn't you be better off with all that money? A man lives in his mind, not in a place. <laughs> no use explaining that to you. I'd be wasting my time. Ugh. Idiots. A world filled with idiots and illiterates. What does the name Plato mean to them? Beethoven, Spinoza, Rembrandt, Schweitzer. Idiots. You all follow one another like a pack of sheep, one following the other. Out in the suburbs where I live, that's... Did I you... ask for your opinion? I was going to say that... Never I... mind what you wanted to say. I'm not interested in what you wanted to say. I'm not giving lessons in democratic principles. Not this semester, lady. Boy, everybody's got an opinion to give you. Everybody's got something to say. They have the background, the training, the, the mental discipline to, to give you an opinion on the facts, on, on objectivity, on scientific comprehension. They don't. They don't, huh? <laughs> no, they don't. Well, you know so much, do you? Who wrote the Divine Comedy? Dante. Uh, when was the Civil War? Oh, between 1861 and 1865. How do you, how do you spell concatenation? Concatenation? C-O-N-C-A-T-E-N-A-T-I-O-N. How do you spell pulchritude? Pulchritude, capital P-U-L-C-H-R-A-T-U-D-E, pulchritude, physiology. Physiology, P-H-Y-S-I-O-L-O-G-Y, somnambulism. Somnambulism, capital S-O-M-N-A-M-B-U-L-I-S-M, somnambulism. Resuscitation. Resuscitation, R-E-S-U-C-S. S-C, S-C, S-C-I-T-A-T-I-O-N. You stupid bird brain.